My name is B.C. Uyedele. Uh, by the grace of God, I am the honorable member representing the good people of Idiroko Epokia State Constituency. I was born in Idiroko. I went to the defunct Egbado South Local Government Primary School. And after my primary education, I proceeded to Eco Gateway Grammar School, also in Idiroko. After that, I proceeded to the prestigious Olabi Soromajo University, Agowe, where I studied transportation planning and management under the Department of Geography and Regional Planning. After that, I can boldly say that I hold a master degree from the same school in public administration. I am a member of the Chartered Institute of Local Government and Public Administration of Nigeria. I served in uh, Benue State, Boko, to be specific. And after that, I then charged into private business. So I have been doing that for years. I have uh, I own the city side fashion outlet. By the grace of God, we also have a lounge, an entertainment hub, where we entertain people, where people can come wine and dine. So I have been to private uh, organization. Uh, before we decided to venture into politics, I contested election for the first time in 2019 and um, the election went somehow but in 2023 I contested again on that and to the glory of God uh, God gave us the victory well uh, city side is born out of um, uh, a passion and was the passion at some point when we were to get started when i was to get registered in 2010 so there was a question of okay what do we call the company i retraced my steps given that i'm a local boy i now feel like well since i'm a local boy i can say that though my town is not a city like that but then it is beside the city so in looking for a name that will suit where i came from and also corroborating it with where i am so i feel like okay we'll call it city side that proved to be the origin of city side the primary function of a member of uh, the status of assembly is to make law so we want to ensure that we robustly make laws and move for uh, life impacting bills that will ensure improvement in the livelihood of my people. I have promised my people, pray out to my emergence, that I will duly represent them. And that we have been doing to the glory of God with the help of the governor we have been able to facilitate a block of four classrooms uh, to Maigi Secondary School in Elashe. So I want to most sincerely appreciate the governor of Ogun State, Prince Dakwa Biodun, C.O.N. He has availed all of us, members of the House of Assembly, that opportunity. And I think it's noteworthy. We have also been able to lay us in the Ministry of Environment because there is a, a part in our local government uh, that uh, houses the uh, uh, fish farmers in our local government. It covers about 200 hectares of land there. And they are known to be the highest producer of fingerlings in the entire Africa because they produce over 40 million 
Paranon of fingerlings. So we have been able to take the Ministry of Environment down to the local government to look at the state as which flood or flooding has been affecting the business of these people. Don't forget that what they are doing there is production. And that has to do with the improvement of the gross domestic product of our state. And therefore, it is important for us to look at that direction in terms of what the problems of our people are and what we can do to ameliorate the problem. So what the people have sent me to do here, I am doing 100%.